Uh, hey, yo, what's up, gamers? Welcome back to another video. It's me again, Blitzler Tala. Today is a Friday. I got home from school and then I went to the gym and then I had a shower now I'm here. Anyways, so you know how in the last video I was talking to you guys about how um I I wrote that movie review. I started making that. I started writing that movie review for The Fly because for our English assignment we had to convince Mr. Lada to watch a movie of our choice that he had not seen before and I had only written two paragraphs then however um I recorded that video at night and then um I proceeded to for the rest of it like for the next few hours I I finished it and I printed it out today at school during social studies class I printed out two copies one for me to keep and one to give to Mr. Ladder um and as you can see it's really nice it's a page long just like you said um he didn't exactly give us that much detail on it, but I know that he likes sci-fi movies. Anyways, here, I'm going to read it. <coughs> the Fly. Movie review. The Fly. A 1986 science fiction horror film directed by David Cronenberg. It has won several awards since its release and has been labelled as one of the best horror movies created. Um, with a modest with a modest budget of only nine to five nine to fifteen million dollars, the film remarkably earned over sixty point six million at the worldwide box office, solidifying its status as as a classic horror film. Um, this movie is centered around an innovative scientist, Seth Brundle, played by Jeff Jeff Goldblum, whose narrative, I mean, whose experiment to revolutionize humanity goes tragically wrong, um, leading to a dark and gruesome narrative. Uh, there are so many distinct aspects of this film. The variety of emotions experienced throughout the film is like a roller coaster. It takes you on an adventure full of confusion, shock, grief, romance, and much more. Um, the fly uses slow development to progress the movie. The film's horror unfolds with a slow building, suspenseful intensity. Um, minor changes begin to a film. Minor changes begin to appear during the film, subtly enhancing the sensations of it all. Uh, for a film developed in 1986, the details are spectacular. The gore and special effects, which I wrote as SFX to abbreviate it. Um, have clearly been constructed with major effort. The level of intricacy laced within this film earned two awards for, ba for best makeup in 1987. Aside from the physical attributes, the, the characters were, ro were, ro were written well, and the actors gave an amazing performance. They speak eloquently and display their emotions clearly, rather than over-exaggerating or showing no emotion whatsoever. The psychological aspects which are highlighted have also been performed in an outstanding, in an outstanding matter, leaving viewers in a state of awe. Cronenberg's filmmaking style and atmosphere also play a crucial role in the success of The Fly. Characterized by dark colors alongside cla claustrophobic settings, a pronounced aesthetic is fostered. Not to mention the eerie soundtrack, which only enhances the m each mood exhibited throughout the film. In conclusion, The Fly is a highly introspective and eccentric film, which delves into topics of metamorphosis, dissociation, and anguish. All of these films are beautifully installed with a sophisticated plotline and horrific yet profound imagery. With the use of its special effects and frightening storytelling, it has certainly contributed to the evolution of the horror slash sci-fi genre. I hope you guys liked it. I, uh, I'm actually so proud of it. No, like legit, I stayed up for hours writing it. I didn't even use AI or I used it to grammar. Oh yeah, that's right. I'd like to say thank you to that person who ran my last speech through ChatGPT to give me constructive criticism. Thanks. I mean, I don't like using AI to make my work because it take I th I feel as though it takes away like the authenticity of it or something because like I want to give it my all so that Mr. Letter can give me like genuine feedback on how I did rather than give c feedback to AI because I didn't even write that I liked it. I mean it's good for like ideas or grammar checking 
but like, but like I'm, I think it's well written, and I'm very proud of it. Anyways, I think my mom's gonna come over to shower soon, and make sure like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you don't want to miss a Bye.